Hello friends, welcome to Internet Networks. My name is Edgar C. Francis. In this video, we are going to see how to configure BGP route reflector with the 2RR server. I am assuming that you already know about the concept behind the route reflector server. If you don't, there is a link in the description box so you can visit it out. So, first we are going to configure the IP addressing as per our topology. First we configure the IP addressing on router 1, 2 and 3 and 4. After this we are going to configure EIGRP to provide reachability between BGP speakers here. After that we are going to configure BGP route reflector on router 2 and router 4. So first we configure the IP addressing on router 1. On router 1 we have uh, four can say the interface the serial 4 slash 0 12 dot network serial 4 slash 3 41 dot network and fastnet 0 slash 0 and loopback 0 12 dot network 41 dot network 10 dot network 11 dot network now router 2 Also, we have four networks, four interface, four slash zero, four slash one, fast net, and loopback. Now on router three, on router three, four slash one, four slash two, okay, twenty three. 34, 30 network and 33, the loopback address. And now on router 4. Post slash 2, which is connected to router 3, 34 network, post slash 3, connected with router 1, post slash 1 and fastnet 0 slash 0 and the loopback address is 44 now verify we show IP interface 3 it's the most important command we verify loopback ok everything looks good 40.9.1 now router 3 network up 23 and 34 up ok now router 2 20 dot network up 12 dot network and 23 dot network and the loopback address 22 now router 1 4 slash 3 connected with router 4 4 slash 2 connected with router 2 and the fast net so everything is good now we are going to configure EIGRP uh, 65100 EIGRP 65100 the network 12 dot network 10 dot 41.0 and 11 dot network you can see the same way we are going to configure on router 2 now on router 2 EIGRP 65 network 12 dot 22 23 and 20 you can see the message the neighborship is up between router 1 and router 2 now we are going to configure our router 3 IGRP. Router IGRP 65100, network 23, 30, 34, 33, 
can see the message. There's the neighbor shape itself between router 2 and router 3. The same way now on router 4. On router 4. EIGRP 65, network 44, 40, 41, 34. The neighbor ship is up between router 3 and router 1. Now, you show IP, EIGRP, neighbor. You can see router 4 is having two neighbor ship between 41 and 34, means router 3 and router 1. Now, router 3. You show IP IGRP neighbors. Neighborship is up between okay, router 3 is having two neighborship, router 4 and router 2. On now check on router 2. You show IP IGRP neighbor. Router 2 is also having two neighborship between router 1 and router 2 and router 1 router, router 2 and router 3 now on router 1 router 1 is also having the neighborship you see after successfully configure the AIGRP and uh, assign the IP address now we configure the BGP and configure router 2 and router 4 as a RR server and router 3 and router 1 work as a client. Before we start the configuring the BGP, we must uh, see the QIP route KGRP. Okay, the 44 network 22, sorry, 22, and 33, 23, okay, and 33, this loopback we are going to use in BGP, so, route EIGRP, okay, on router 3, Okay, everything is good. Okay. Also, eleven dot network, twenty two dot network, thirty three dot network. Okay, now we are ready to for configuration BGP. Starting from router one. Router BGP sixty five one hundred. The network is twenty two dot one dot one. The motor is sixty five one hundred, which is router two. All the networks, all the routers in the AS65100. The update source loopback and the neighbor 44 network and the network turned off. Now we got configure on router 2. Router 2. Eleven dot network. Which is our router one, thirty three dot network, which is router three, and eleven dot network and thirty three dot network, which is router one and router three, are route reflector clients means router two, act as a RR server. The same way we configure on router three, you can see the message. The neighborship is up between router 1 and router 2 through EIGR yes, to BGP. Now router 3. Twenty-two dot network 
the loop back mm -hmm. and 44 network the loop back network 30 dot network no auto summary you can see the message the neighborship is up between router 2 and router 3 now we are going to configure on router 4 and make router 4 is also a RR server okay router BGP 6500 the neighbor 33 neighbor 11 means router 3 and router 1 the neighbor 11 dot network is a router vector climb neighbor 33 network means router 3 is a router of electric line you can see the message the neighborship is up between router 1 and router 3 now show IP GP summary and again match ok see the neighbors the AS ok so IP BGP 30.1.1.1 can see the received from the RR client ok see the router 4 is receiving this 30.1.1.1 network from route reflector client if we try to dot one dot one dot one you can see this network is also learned from RF client okay. I hope you like this video uh, if you like, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.